वेलकम टू सिंह सिंह स्टूडियो गैस एंड दिस इज अविनाश अगेन new video after a couple of days and uh, I know you guys waited so long for your result and finally the result is out for NIFT Masters be it Masters in Design, Masters in Fashion Management or Masters in Fashion Technology. Finally the result is out and congratulations to all the candidates who got a very good rank and are ready to boom in the design industry. Alright so today's video is the same we are going to talk about category rank, common merit rank, how to evaluate your rank and how to know whether you have any chance you get a chance for Delhi Bombay or if you do not have any chance how to know that or how to be sure all right moving forward again that is not guaranteed this is just an assumption or our prior experience I'm going to talk about what are the chances for you all right so these are the candidates from our Institute first of all who got selected in master's design today rank 1 Shubhankar Sarkar rank 2 Madhavendra Jha he is in master in fashion technology rank 3 Shamli Naikwari she is from Nagpur she secured rank 3 in this master's in design rank 17 Pallavi Mandal she is from Bangalore she also secured we are still waiting for a couple of more students who secured a uh, good rank we are trying to establish the contact with them and I will update it as soon as possible all right so moving forward word uh see basically what is common merit rank and what is category rank that's what you have to understand or you have to know so common merit rank first of all let's talk about that common merit rank and there is category rank now common merit rank are for open or general category uh, that is category rank for SC, ST, OBC, EWS, PWD. So these are, or these are, like th these are category ranks. So the students who have secured or who belong to open or general category, this category rank is of no use. You have to understand that, right? That category rank is only for even this year. NIFT has announced uh, the result in collaboration with NTA. And it is in detail that how much you have scored in creative, how much you have scored in GAT, how much you have scored interview in your interview round. So it is very clear. and You can actually see where exactly you lacked. All right. So this year also it used to have like you know previously uh, NIFT used to release uh, common merit rank as well as category rank for open category as well but this time it is not it's simply straightforward if you belong to open category you can only see the common merit rank you cannot see credit rank uh, that is category rank all right so coming to the point they have released only common merit rank specifically for the student who belongs to open and general category. So do not get confused first of all because I started getting messages on Instagram and WhatsApp since morning said that I cannot see my category rank. No, you won't because you belong to general category. Even if you would have been able to see the category rank, it is of no use because Category rank is only counted for SC, ST, OBC, EWS and PWD categories. That is it. For open, it is of no use. So, let's say, like our student, he has secured rank 1. Absolutely. So, he is definitely going to get Delhi. Because usually, Delhi closes between 1 to 38. Right? So, that is uh, the common merit rank. Now half of this seat, like 38 seats are there, let's say half of the seats are for general category and rest half are reserved for SC, ST, OBC and rest EWS and PWD. Right now, this 19 seat obviously. Now, some of you will say that uh, you have a common merit rank of uh, 350, but category rank you have 20. 
Why? Which is a good, good rank because you belong to, let's say, SC category or ST category. In that case, you got this rank under the reservation quota, right? Otherwise, you would have got 350, but now you have 20. So the chances are high that you may get not Delhi in case in case if you don't get Delhi because chances are less in uh, rank 20 right so uh, if you belong to SC particularly or ST so in that case the chances are that you may get Mumbai or Gandhinagar right you need to understand that uh, only seven campuses deals in masters in design i'm currently talking about masters in design only seven campuses deals in master, masters in design in masters in fashion management all 18 campuses in mfm and in mf tech four campus right so uh, again, I gave you an example. Let's say you have a common merit rank of 80 and a category rank 59. All right. So your common merit rank is 80, category rank 59, you belong to OBC category. Let's say that. So here, the chances are you're not going to get Delhi, no Mumbai, no Bangalore, you may get a chance in Gandhinagar or in case if not Gandhinagar then Panchkula Kangra and Kunur so these are the campuses deals in masters in design Delhi Mumbai, Bangalore, Gandhinagar, Panchkula, Kangra and Kunu. So I'm talking about do not make an assumption that if you have a common merit rank of uh, uh, 240 and credit, uh, category rank is uh, 170 then you will get Delhi, Bombay or Bangalore. No, absolutely not. Even in fact the chances are very less that you will get any seat in this rank even if you have a category rank. So to secure a campus if you belong to a category you need to score rank below 100 110 120 somewhere about in category and if you belong to general category chances you will have to score somewhere about below 300 then only you stand a chance to secure a campus not Delhi or Mumbai or Bangalore you'll have a chance to secure a campus but with this rank you may have to wait till last round of counseling which you know uh, either fourth round or fifth round of counseling so it depends all right so that is another thing same goes with MFM now in MFM there are 18 campuses dealing in so I'm taking an average of 38 seats though in some of the campuses there are only 34 seats so I'm taking an average here so 18 campuses and 38 seats so it comes around nearly 620 seats somewhere about it's just an, I'm not calculating exactly but I'm just giving you an idea so let's say 700 so let's 700 seats it's total in total that means SC, ST, OBC, EWS, PWD and general category so just an assumption that though out of that 700 350 for general the rest 350 are divided into SC, ST, OBC, EWS and PWD so here what plays role that if you belong to a general category and if you have scored below 400 or 450 you stand a chance to secure a campus but if you are crossing about 550 or nearly 600 absolutely no chance that you are going to get any seat 
right same goes with category so category here if you in category wise if you are uh, scoring below 300 in category rank in category rank if you are scoring below 300 you stand a chance to secure a seat right but don't say that uh, with the 300 rank can i get delhi bombay because i get this silly question every year with a rank of 240 still a student makes a call are there any chance in delhi no absolutely not there is no chance in delhi or mumbai or bangalore or gandhi nagar simple you have to know the seat map matrix uh, how many seats are there in every campus and how exactly they are divided in different categories you can calculate by yourself it's not a very big math here that you cannot calculate okay so it's not so much of a rank is up so you can also make a choice and all the campuses are equally good so run behind the stream not behind the campus as Sanyukta ma'am always told you guys and guided in her videos that run behind your stream now in MFM and in MDS obviously there are no specific stream selection unlike in uh, bachelor's in design but here at least you have a mindset that you want to do management in fashion and no other institution in India giving such kind of excellent education in management in fashion or fashion management so you know this is your core area where you want to go so if you are getting any campus go for it trust me it is worth it all right for MF Tech there are only four campuses that is Delhi Bangalore Chennai and Gandhinagar now Delhi has I guess 34 seats rest have 38 seats now again if you'll calculate the overall number of seats you can divide it by two which is for general and rest uh, another uh, you know uh, another 50% uh, for SC, ST, OBC, WS and uh, PWD it's just a mere calculation and assumption what we are trying to do here so here if you got a rank and if you have any query you can put your query in the comment section of this video go through it first of all watch the complete video still if you do not understand put your query in the comment section i'll be happy to help you there or else if you do not get a reply in the comment section you can follow us on our instagram which is ss design house and after following you can put us a dm and i'll make sure that you get your reply right on time so that is what we have been helping you guys right and uh, please do not make a call instead you can drop a text and uh, on whatsapp there also i will be replying you guys or saying tamam she'll be replying you guys right so this was it about masters in design fashion technology wait for the counseling uh, there will be a separate video for counseling how to appear how to fill the preferences if this is going to happen online and what if it takes place offline there is also a very big procedure uh, which i'm going to explain you throughout my videos so wait for the next video till then take care bye bye and one more thing here in the comment section please put what is the next video you are looking for and i'll definitely try to make it me or sanitam any one of us till then take care bye bye